one of my friends actually sir got a very good rank last year so he recommended speed to me initially i watched the videos so then i did the questions then i gave the tests basic preparation of every exam is approximately the same speed was also a very imp- important uh, uh, part of my journey in this exam i bring in all the wishes and greetings on behalf of the speed medical institute and the faculty of speed medical institute doctor to doctor uh, kislaya kamal for scoring rank number 7 in dm gastroenterology in ines session april 2024 congratulations to doctor thank you sir thank you so much great doctor can we know a little brief background about yourself where you started till date what all you have done yes sir sir i was born born and brought up in patna sir i did my 12th there and then i did my mbbs and md from king george medical university in lucknow okay doctor and sir i finished my completed my md last year in the month of august and then i gave my nss exam and uh, last year also okay Yes, sir. Why gastroenterology? Uh, in spite of so many specialities, I mean, specific passion and interest towards that subject. Sir, uh, first of all, uh, because uh, um, a lot of uh, the cases that I saw during my MD days were of uh, chronic liver disease, Hep B patient, Hep C patients. Mm-hmm. Uh, so there is where my uh, interest interest spiked in uh, gastro. Uh, also, uh, because it is a mix of mix of intervention also. So, okay. Uh, i could do a lot of intervention things and some of my friends used to ask uh, ki how do you do this and i was good at it uh, center line insertions and intubations and all so uh, i don't know it is not the same i know but the, but the thing is uh, there is a mix of it so so that is where i thought ki it is uh, uh, it is i can pursue this also there is a, there is a, there is a mix of um, um, uh, hepatitis completely non interventional not completely but the basic it is non interventional and the luminal is interventional so it is a good mix of it <laughs> very nice very nice so looking at it people who want missed surgery also do this actually they want yeah, to do some yes. idea had a surgery in mind but they taken medicine but to compensate that feeling they yes, <laughs> yes sir medical gastro also right very yeah. good now once you have decided to go for medical gastro and uh, what all you did to achieve this today uh so uh, first of all uh, the, the things that we read in uh, read in our md days is very different than what is asked in especially in aims uh, so uh, it was uh, uh, initially it was difficult uh, to uh, to focus on what is really being asked and where to study that from and um, because uh, ini is also focused mainly on the on the speciality because approximately 50 to 60 questions are being asked on the spe- speciality so uh, so it is difficult to understand what all uh, they are going to ask also the luminal gastro we don't have that much exposure in our mb days so uh, uh, so um, initially i watched the videos uh, also then i did the questions then i gave the tests uh, so basic 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 preparation of every exam is approximately the same okay. uh, yes sir um, then uh, ini also requires a uh, uh, a special edge regarding the recent papers and recent guidelines so uh, some guidelines i followed like um, uh, babano consensus guidelines and then the leon consensus then acg guidelines i read some of it not all i couldn't read all so uh, all the important topics or or the guidelines are very uh, concise actually so sometimes when i used to did not you uh, did not um, uh, understand from the videos or the questions then i try to see the guidelines some of it not all so you were working on studying or uh, i mean full yes. time yes sir actually i was just coming from my duties only wow. uh, <laughs> okay i am currently working as a senior resident in government institute of medical sciences in greater noida i am actually under bond right now so uh, i am doing my uh, senior residency okay so how you come across speed then how you uh, got into uh, learning from there one of my friends actually sir got a very good rank last year so he recommended speed to me and uh, that is why i uh, started watching the videos also i uh, got a lot of uh, uh, got a lot of feedback from a lot of my friends who were preparing that dr sir videos are really nice prashant sir videos are, is also on there so uh, so i, I uh, that is how i came to know um yes sir so are you able to watch all the videos no sir <laughs> there are a lot of videos <laughs> really you have to select and uh, you have matlab the Uh, i watched the slesinger based videos uh, of uh, gallbladder uh, uh, of um, luminal part because it is really difficult to understand the initial portion of slesinger where uh, all the general uh, uh, chapters obesity portion then the nutrition part all those videos i watched 
and the gall bladder portion i washed the pancreas i washed and uh, some portions of liver i could not wash the whole hepatology uh, luminal i tried to do because it is difficult to understand by reading schlesinger i couldn't couldn't read also schlesinger i could read the whole of it Yes. What about what about your practice and test? I mean, did you had a required uh, grant test and test done for to practice and to assess yourself? Yes, sir. Uh, the questions are very difficult. First of all, I thought that the questions are really difficult. So yeah, but once you once you uh, solve some questions, then you understand that okay, this is actually important. What what is important? What is not? so uh, by question and uh, by uh, giving a question by doing questions and by looking at the answers i understood ki, ki what can be asked all of those things have been already taught but our focus doesn't go there by it is only after doing the questions we realize ki okay this is this is really important this can be asked in this way so that is where i understood ki okay because i i remember that i i, I had read it that, that is given in a schlesinger table but our focus doesn't go there that this can be asked in this way Um, because i remember there is a there was a question of sphincter of aortic dysfunction and um, i never really used to think okay uh, what are the different gates and how progressed and how that can be asked so yeah yes oh wow. great now how many questions did you attend doctor in the exam i attempted sir uh, 78 70 78 questions oh, close to maximum yes yes sir only i i only did not because i was getting the feeling that the paper is uh, not one where i can leave a lot of questions so i thought ki i should uh, only those questions which i really didn't even know any word of it i left great yes now about the interview can you share some of the experiences that you had in your interview to tell us what you yes, have to ask uh, sir the interview was basically divided between three sessions uh, luminal uh, and uh, uh, pancreatic biliary and hepatobiliary so basically the interviewers are basically focused on uh, uh, on the general approach i uh, remember they asked me a question ki if a patient is having just pain abdomen just pain abdomen leave everything else just pain abdomen what are your duties so they are just trying to look at if we have a general approach general general idea about you don't have a tunnel vision i think i don't know i'm not an i, I have not been an interviewer also there is a lot of anxiety sir because they are aims faculty so we all um, i i had a lot of a lot of anxiety i prepared uh, by watching the isg master class videos sir uh, because they are really helpful also a lot of questions in the aims theory paper uh, i saw that the, uh, a lot of questions were from there they are not this time but the previous questions but some previous papers they had a lot of questions from there also they have really good faculty from outside of india also who can come and give their talks so it is very very insightful very it, it is very crisp at the same time all the uh, all the faculty only discuss the the videos there so it is very very ins- insightful and also very informative so that is how i prepared general uh, also the case discussions are also very good you get an idea ki what the what the uh, professors really want to know what is the approach because we don't have we really have a good approach in our md days regarding cases of gastro um, uh, only the the only cases that we get discussed in our nicely uh, during our md days are cns and cvs cases Uh, and uh, some part of respiratory cases not a lot of gastro in our md so so that is where we uh, i uh, understood ki okay this is a really important how to approach a case of diarrhea or mal malabsorption uh, so i i prepared by mainly watching isg videos then i go, went through some of my notes also for the interview okay. i did not yes sir great doctor thank you sir now, what is the message that you want to give to your juniors or aspiring for dm gastro sir i basically uh, uh, the resources are all out there sir but there is a certain uh, amount of uh, edge that you need uh, for clearing ini and that is uh, uh, detail sir videos are but really uh, uh, really helpful some some of the things that he taught were more uh, towards the giving providing you an edge rather than discussing the same things over and over again so that was really helpful sir also sir i want to say that uh, Uh, reading schlesinger is very difficult uh, and to when it is not really possible so going through the tables is important also doing some questions from the schlesinger review i did some question i did i could complete approximately 70 80% questions from the schlesinger review uh, but it the questions are very big it takes a lot of time reading the explanations is very tedious so it is not really easy to consolidate everything but yeah at the end of the day revision and consolidation matters it, it matters the most 
see if if we can understand there are there are you said there are plenty of resources available but you need a edge to crack it means yes, you, you feel that that is the most important crux of speed of uh, yes sir huh? yes sir yes sir because because uh, you, you can't go through every guidelines out there mm. uh, you need to have a mentor who can provide you that ki mm. this is the, this is the guidelines this is important in this guidelines and just be done with it nothing more yeah so, this is what i am hearing directly or indirectly from various topics yes sir all that available attending the exam is there but to crack there is need something else there is some uh, thing is to crack the edge to crack yes. the exam to score in top 10 there is something yes. else required I mean, yes i really appreciate the efforts taken by you and also all the faculty members dr deeraj yes, all the faculties who have, who have understood what is needed that is very important right? yes, <laughs> yes so that the students should win that's very important see yeah, learning is uh, aspect but end of the day the outcome the result uh, means a lot for a student that he wants to go to the next stage of career and yes. uh, and i really congratulate both the in the entire team of, of the faculty and also the students who made it yes sir. if I, if i could see that is or or a observation from the last two three days as taking interview back to back yes yes and this is what uh, everybody feels that to give what is required for the exam is the most important very good yes. now uh, what is the uh, uh, thing that you want to thank that who all helped you to build your career so far sir first of all i want to thank my parents because they have been very patient with me very patient very very encouraging very supportive at the right time uh, every time supportive at every time sir so first of all them some of my friends were very helpful because uh, uh, they helped me a lot and uh, it you need a support system behind you to crack any exam i think also at this stage of time sir my my consultants here were, were also helpful they allowed me the time to go and study ki ha theek hai you have your interview go and prepare you have your exam go and prepare you don't have to come so uh, i i i have a, i have first i really uh, appreciate and i have a lot of gratitude for the people that i have in my life right now excellent and once again i congratulate you and on behalf of the entire team i wish you all the very best and all the success for a great career in gastroenterology thank you so like much like gastroenterologist in making and is going to rock and is going to do all that he can and i wish you for that all the best and all the success thank you sir speed was also a very impo- important uh, uh, part of my journey in this exam thank you very much doctor for acknowledging thank you. and thank it you. means a lot to all the team the entire team of speed thank you thank you thank, thank you so much